had wings. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another pregnancy test. I just filmed a pregnancy test last week. Um, if you haven't seen that, I will link it up here for you. But obviously, it was a negative um, pregnancy test because here I am today, and I am going to test again. So it's been a full week. I tested last Thursday, and today is Thursday. Um, and it was a negative last week, but I know my eyes always play tricks on me with these pregnancy tests, and I always feel like I can see a test, or I can see a line, even when it's not there. I've been trying to get pregnant since October, and every single time I take a pregnancy test, I feel like I see the faintest line ever. But again, it's just my eyes playing tricks on me just because I wanna see that line so bad. If you haven't seen last week's pregnancy test, definitely watch that because I explain um, like t my TTC journey and I just update you on um, trying to conceive and everything that's been going on. And I don't wanna repeat it right now in this video, so you should definitely go check that one out just so you kinda know what's been going on lately. So I tested last week, it was negative, and I'm gonna test one more time before I start the Provera, which will trigger my period, and then start my second round of Clomid. So we did not take Clomid this cycle, which you guys already know if you watched my last week's pregnancy test, but I'm just still really, 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 really praying and hoping that it is a positive. I haven't really had many pregnancy symptoms. I've been a little bit moody, because so I'm not really a moody person, and I've noticed that I've been a little moody. Um, I feel like my boobs have been like a tiny bit tender here and there, but you know, who really knows? <laughs> I feel like I also make stuff up in my head because I wanna be pregnant so bad that I just start making myself believe that I'm pregnant and every little thing that happens to me, you know, I start thinking that that's a symptom even when it's not. I don't know what DPO I am because I don't know when or if I even ovulated this cycle. It's kind of just um, a guessing game for me, but I do know that I am cycle day. Let's check, because I'm keeping track of it in my app. Um, I am cycle day 34, and my doctor did say that when I hit cycle day 35, if it is a negative pregnancy test, I can go ahead and start my Provera, and I think that's what I'm gonna do. I don't think I'm gonna wait this one out like I usually do. I usually like to test a few times before I start the Provera just to make sure, but I feel like if it's negative, it's negative. And I don't wanna wait any longer for my next cycle. I really just wanna go ahead and start the next cycle and start my next cycle of Clomid as soon as I can because I really wanna just get this show on the road and get pregnant. Like, ugh. I just really, really, really want another baby and I want Cam to be a sibling and so yeah, anyway, today is cycle day 34 and I'm going to test tonight. I know you guys, so many people comment and tell me not to test in the evening and to test in the morning, but it's so hard to test in the morning because Alex is home and I really, really want to surprise him if I'm pregnant and it's just so hard to like film and talk to you guys. Like I can test in the morning, but I won't be able to film it. I really love filming these for you guys. As I told you in my last vlog are like the best support system for me and so I really do like filming these and enjoy putting them up for you guys so i have to wait until he goes to work out for me to film them or if he you know takes camden up to the park which he usually does in the afternoon then i can do it then as well but right now cam is sleeping alex is home with him like he's napping and i ran out to cvs to buy some more pregnancy tests because i was out like i had none and um, they're so expensive at CVS. I recommend getting them on Amazon if you're gonna buy them just because they're cheaper there. They'll ship right to your house so you don't have to like run out. But I don't have enough time to order them on Amazon right now and I should have done it earlier in the week like I had planned, but I didn't. I just decided to go up to CVS and pay the $22 for <laughs> two first response pregnancy tests. I'll show you which ones I ended up getting because I was gonna get the clear blue ones that say pregnant or not pregnant, but um, I know First Response is such an amazing brand, and um, I thought this was interesting. They have, there's two tests in here, and so it includes like a confirmation test. So I will test with the one that has the two lines, and if there is a faint line on there, I can go ahead and test with this confirmation pregnancy test that'll just say yes or no, which I think is really cool and exciting, and hopefully I'll get to use them both today, but um, yeah, it only comes with two tests, and it was $22, which is absolutely insane. I'm gonna go ahead and head home and take this test. Can 
you say hi YouTube? Hi kids. Hi to you. <laughs> You're so cute. Can I have a kiss? <laughs> that was a big monster kiss. <laughs> Little update, I have not tested Papa. yet. I'm waiting for... Papa. Papa. <laughs> yeah, they see the football. Wow. 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 <laughs> I'm waiting for Alex to take Cam out to the park for a little bit. Dada. Dada's down there? Dada, Dada. What's he doing? Is he working? You want to go outside? Dada. You want Dada to take, to take you outside? Dada. I'll take you out. You want to go out with me? No. You don't want to go outside with me? Dada. Hmm. Hi, King. <laughs> you say hi to? Hi, King. <laughs> say I love you. I love you, King. Oh, I love you, YouTube. That was sweet, honey. Okay, so Alex just took Camden up to the park. It's 5:42. So I am actually gonna pee in a cup this time. Last week I did the whole like pee on a stick thing and got it everywhere. Like I covered the whole stick in my pee. It was really great. Okay, so I just dipped the test for five seconds, and now I have to wait, I think, three minutes. So it's 5.47 right now, and we will wait till 5.50, and then we'll see what it says. I'm getting really nervous, like I always do right before I look at a pregnancy test. I have to take, like, deep breaths, and just, I, w I want to prepare myself for the negative result. Like, I just want to prepare myself, because I hate when I get super disappointed and bummed, it just like ruins my night. I'm sure you guys can understand. All right, it's 5.51, so it's been like four minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and look at the test. What do you guys think it is? It's what you think it is. It's a negative. just sucks. I think I'm out this cycle, you guys. I think that's it. Well, that is the end of this video. Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you for your support. Thank you for being there for me. And um, thank you for your prayers and your thoughts and your sweet words because they always make me feel better. And I know posting this. I know that you guys are just going to be super sweet like you always are and it does make me feel better. So just before I even read the comments, just in advance, I want to say thank you so much for all the love. I know that at some point, someday, I will get that positive and it'll be so exciting and I cannot wait to share it with all of you. So we'll just keep praying and we'll keep being positive and we'll keep being hopeful and we'll just keep trying and hopefully soon enough, We'll get there, but 
Thank you guys again so much for watching. I hope that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked this video and hit the little bell notification next to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. If you had wings just like a bird